A very good afternoon to all of you children. In today's session, let us have a short recap on all the topics what we have learnt. That is, let us do a revision on all these topics. That is worksheet 1, 2, 3 and 4. That is nouns and kinds of nouns. Okay, so let's move on to it. Yes. So, Agdal Gills, come on, tell me, what is a noun? Yes, Agdal Gills. Agdal Gills, come on, tell me, what is a noun? Yes, unmute it, my dear. Yes, ma'am. Yes, come on, tell me, what is a noun? A noun is a word used as the name of a person, place, animal or a thing. Very good, Agnal Gills. So, noun is a word that names a person, place, animal or a thing. Very good. Then we have learnt about the different kinds of noun. So, we have completed already with common noun, proper noun and the collective noun. So, who can give me the answer? Okay, Saharish. Come on, Saharish. Uh, what is a common noun? A common name given to a person, place, animal or a thing is... Very good. Is a common name given to a person, place, animal or thing of the same kind. Very good. Okay, Ivan Nirmal, come on, tell me. What is a proper noun? Yes, Ivan. Um, a proper noun... Is a... Um, a proper noun is a place... What name? Um, is a special name. A special name mm. given to mm. a person, mm. particular name. Yes, is a special name given to a particular person, place, animal or a thing. Okay, very good. Okay, is a special name. Ivan Nirmal is a special name given to a boy, given to a particular person. Okay, given to a boy. So, Ivan Nirmal is a name of a. So, Ivan Nirmal is a proper noun. So, it's a special name given to a particular person, place, animal or a thing. Have you understood? Each thing has their own name. So, that name is known as their own special name. That is a proper noun. Okay. Okay, now we, let's move on to Renfred. Renfred, come on, tell me what is a collective noun. Yes, Renfred. Collective noun is a noun used for type of groups. Louder, please. A, a collective noun is a noun used for any type of group. That relates to? Group? group? Of animals? It's not audible, that's what I'm asking. Ma'am? Yes. A collective noun is a noun used for any type of groups. Uh. Of animal, uh. person, uh. and thing. Yes, very good. Okay. So, collective noun is nothing but it's a collection or a group of. Group of people, animals or things. And each group it is considered has one whole. Because each collective noun that each group it is considered has one unit. Okay. So, then we learnt about the different groups. Okay, then we learnt about the specific collective nouns. I told you to learn it very well. So, let me ask you a few questions related to that now. Uh, what do we call a group of players? Emmanuel, come on, tell me. What is a collective noun used for a group of players? Emmanuel, not there. Okay, Evelyn, come on, Evelyn. Evelyn? Yes, ma'am. Yes, come on. For a group of players. Yes. Team. Team. Very good. Team. Johan, come on. Johan, for a group of, for a group of people, which is a, coll a collective noun used for that? For a group of people. The collective noun used for a group of people that refers to a group of people. Yes. Mm -hmm. The collective noun that refers to a group of people. 
people. People for when people gather together, what do we call them? Yes, Johan. All are ready with their answers. Yes. Yes, the answer passes on to Aradhya. Come on, Aradhya. Come on, tell me the answer. Crowd. Yes. Crowd. Once more. Crowd. Yes, very good. It is crowd of people. Very good. One more question based on that. What do we call a, for a group of birds? The question goes to Amaya. Come on, Amaya. For a group of birds, what do we say? What is the collective noun that refers to group of birds? Flock. Flock. Very good. Now let's move on to today's topic. Okay, my dear children. It is just a revision. So I know you're familiar with all these. So after the revision, we'll move on to the worksheet. So we know that noun is a word that refers to used to name a person, place, animal, or a thing. So a noun is a word that names a person, place, animal, or a thing. Then we learned about the different kinds of noun. That is, <clears throat> all of you look at the slide. These are the nouns. The names given to persons, places, animals, and things are called nouns. All of you, please have a look at it. I hope all of you can see the boat very well. Okay, so nouns are nothing but names given to persons, places, animals, and things are called nouns. Okay, now, now let's move on to the different kinds of noun. We have learned about the different kinds of noun. We have learned about the common noun, proper noun, and the collective noun, also material noun. We have completed. But for the periodical test, let us revise on common noun, proper noun, and the collective noun. Material noun, we'll be doing it later. So we know that common noun is nothing but common names given to people, places, animals, and things of the same kind. Is that clear? Of the same kind. So we call, they are called as common nouns. Okay. Now let's move on to the proper noun. Proper noun is nothing but it's a special name given to a particular person, place, animal or thing. And proper nouns are always written in capital letter. <clears throat> so we have seen many examples related to the topic. You are familiar with all these examples. I'm not moving on to it. Now let's move on to a the exercise part of it, let me ask you a few questions related to this topic. Okay. Catherine, come on, Catherine. Yes, read the first question and tell me, pick out the proper nouns in the sentence. Neha gave the book to Neetu. Yes, Neha gave the book to Neetu. Yes. Now pick out the proper nouns. Neha and Neetu. Very good. Neha and Neetu. Very good. Okay. Mayuga. Come on. Read the second question and pick out the proper nouns in that sentence. Yes. Priya told. Come on. Read the question. I hope the slide is very clear to all of you. Yes. Priya. Priya told. Preeti. Mm. Mm. Priya told Preeti to bring her a come on, mm. a box of box of chocolates. Chocolates. Okay, so Preeti. Yes, Preeti and Priya. So both are proper nouns. Okay, very good. Adidev M. Nair, come on. <coughs> Read the third question and come on, tell me which is the common noun of that sentence. King oh, made us. We we is a great man. Was a greedy man. Yes, King Midas was a greedy man. Come on, tell me. Man. Man, very good. It is man as a common noun there. Very good. Okay, Rohan. Come on, Rohan. 
Come on, read the next question and come on, tell me, pick out the proper noun in that sentence. Sona is the tallest girl in the school. Okay. Sona. Sona, very good. Sona is a proper noun there. Okay, Mivon and Miva. Come on. Yes, read the fifth question. Bangalore is hmm. a famous city. Okay, pick out the proper noun. Bangalore. Bangalore, very good. And which is a common noun in that sentence? City. City, very good. Okay. So, so this is how we uh, identify the proper noun and the common noun in the sentence. Now let's move on to the collective noun. Collective noun we know it is a group of, group of what? People, animals and things. Okay, so I've told you it's people, animals and things. Okay, so this group has to be learned well. I've told you collective nouns, the specific collective nouns. We use specific collective nouns when we talk about certain groups. So these groups, we have to learn it well. So for the players, for a group of players, the collective noun that refers to group of players is team. Okay. Group of people, the collective noun that refers to group of people is crowd. For soldiers, it's a group. For students, we use the students. Yes, for students, we use class. Class of students. Students, yes, it is class. For a group of students, the collective noun that refers to group of students, it is class. Okay, so all of you please do revise those very well. These are very, very important. So for a group of cows and elephants, the collective noun that refers to cows, group of cows as well as for elephants, we use herd. Herd of cows or herd of elephants. For fish, it is shawl of fish. Okay, for birds as well as for sheep, we use that a group of birds as well as for group of sheep. Okay, the collective noun that refers to group of birds and sheep, it is flock. Okay, for grapes as well as for keys, it is bunch and for flowers, it is bouquet. Okay, so the options will be given for you. You have to click on to the right options, you know it. You have already done a class test. Okay, here we are going to identify the collective noun from the given sentences. So what we have to do, Aradhya, sorry, not Aradhya, Jessica. Jessica, come on. Where is Jessica? Yes, Jessica. Are you there, Jessica? No? Okay, Hedelin, come on. Hedelin, come on, Hedelin. Come on, read the first question and come on, tell me. Identify the collective noun in the sentence. Hedelin? Proud was very big. Yes. Now, come on, identify the... Proud... Crowd, very good. Crowd, very good. Now, Sreya, Sreya, come on. Take the next question. Uh, her heart, a herd of elephant mm. uh, is yes, passing. passing. Mm. So, herd. Herd, very good. Herd. Adrinath, read the next question. Yes, ma'am. Mm. Our team mm. won the match. Yes, our team won the match. Now pick out the or identify the collective noun from the sentence. Ma'am, team. Team, very good. Shine, come on, Shine. Read the fourth question, my dear. Yes, ma'am. Yes, he gave me. He gave me. A bunch of grapes. Yes, so. Bunch. Bunch, very good. Thank you. Yes, now Adidev CN. Come on, Adidev. Come on, do the last question. Yes, ma'am. Mm. The mm. troop of soldiers. The troop of soldiers has. Mm. Had marched. Had marched. Mm. Yeah. Had marched all day. So, all identify day. the collective noun from the sentence. Troop. 
Troop, very good. It is troop. Okay. So that is over. So now let's move on to the exercises. That is the worksheet. I have an interesting worksheet for you. Okay. So this is your worksheet. Okay. Uh, this is quite interesting. What you have to do is... Now I'm going to add one more to it. Yes. So, what color is it? I'll give it the blue color. <coughs> so, for collective noun, Collective noun, it is blue. Collective noun, it is not there. So we will add something to it. So when I saw this exercise, it was quite interesting. So I thought I can, few, I can add few circles here and there. And I can ask it to do it. So it is crowd, team, flock. Okay, I also have written it in black. Okay. So now what we are supposed to do is, we have to pick out a circle and identify whether it is a common noun or a proper noun or a collective noun. So two examples are given for you. Apple, we know it's a common noun. All fruits and all vegetables are considered as common noun. So it is colored in yellow. John, it's a name of a, it's a special name given to a particular person, John. So it's a proper noun and it is colored in green color. Okay, so let's move on. Are you all ready? Yes? Yes. yes. Okay. Now, here. Uh, who hasn't got the chance? Esther, we'll start with Esther. Esther, come on, Esther. So I'm going to pick up the word India. Come on, tell me whether it's common noun, proper noun, or collective noun. India. Man, proper noun. Proper noun. So it should be colored in? Green color. Green. Very good. So it should be colored in green color. Have you understood? Okay. Yes. All of you mute your audios. Yes, muted audios, all of you? Yes, ma'am. Muted? Yes. So it should be colored in green. Has India is a proper noun, is a name of a country. Okay, country which we live in. Okay, now let's move on to Agnes. Agnes, are you there? Yes. Yes, ma'am. Come on, tell me which noun it is. Which kind of noun it is? What? Kind it is. I. I. So here you have to color I. Is it common noun, proper noun, or collective noun? I. Parts of the body is considered as what nouns? Proper noun. How come? Is it a proper noun? I. Common. Common. Yes. Parts of the body are considered as common noun. Okay. So, I have to color it in? Hello. Hello. Very good. So, I have to color it in? Hello. Okay. Now, let's move on to the next word. Jisil. Come on, Jisil. Jisil. Come on. Bird. Yes, ma'am. Yes, bird. What noun it is? 
whether it's common noun, proper noun, or collective noun. Proper noun? Bird, B-I-R-D. Whether it's common noun, proper noun, or collective noun. Come on, think and tell me, children. Bird. It's a common name given to all the birds. So what noun it is? For all the birds, we call it as just birds, animals, no? Insects. Common noun? Common noun. It's a common noun. For all the birds, commonly we use the name it as birds, whether it is whatever the name is. Okay. So we commonly we call it as birds for animals. Okay. For insects. So bird is a common noun. So we have to color it in yellow. Have yeah. you understood? Okay. So bird is a common noun. So let us color that in yellow. Very good. Okay. Now let's move on to the next person, Ayush. Come on, Ayush. I'm going to move on it's to California. California. What noun it is? Which, which noun? California. What noun it is? Is it proper noun? Proper common noun. noun? Huh? Proper noun. Very good. It's a name of a place. So it is proper noun. So what color I have to give in? I have to color California in? Which color? Green. 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 Very good. Green. I have to color it in green color. Very good. Okay. As California is a proper noun. Okay. Now let's move on to the next person. All of you turn on your videos, children. Let me see you all. All of you turn on your videos. Pavan, come on, Pavan. Pavan, come on. Bunch. What noun it is? Bunch. Bunch. What noun it is? It is? Bunch. Common noun. How come, my dear? Proper noun, common noun? Oh. What kind it is? Bunch of grapes. What is that? What is that? Bunch of grapes. What noun it is? Collective noun. Children, when you look at the words, you can't identify whether it's a common noun or a proper noun or a collective noun. Yes, when we look at the words, it's very easy. Bunch is a collective noun. Okay? Bunch is a collective noun. Bunch, it's a collective noun. Yes. Now let's move on to next. Anna Maria. Come on, Anna. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ball. What noun it is? Ball. Ball. What noun? Common it? noun. Common noun. Very good. So I have to color it in? Yellow. 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 Very good. Thank you, ma'am. Yes. Then. Manha. Come on, Manha. Taj Mahal, what noun it is? Taj Mahal. Taj Mahal. Manha is not there. Manha, come on, unmute it. You're not able to. Ma'am? Yes? Common noun. Taj Mahal, what noun it is? How many Taj Mahals are there? Uh, Ma'am? Ah, what noun it is? Whether it's common noun, proper noun, or collective noun? Collective noun. Very poor. What noun it is? Taj Mahal. Proper. Ah, it's a proper noun. Have you not yes. seen the Taj Mahal? It's a name yes. of the building. Yes. So and Taj Mahal it. is a proper noun, so it should be colored in which color, my dear? Ma'am, uh, green. Ah, green. Children, when you look at the word, you should be able to identify whether it's a common noun, proper noun, or a collective noun. Now we are uh, moving on to the next chapter as such. We should be thorough with the nouns now. Then why again? Devatmak, come on, Devatmak. 
Come on, tell me, heard what noun it is. Yes, ma'am. Now we should be thorough with all these nouns. Yes, ma'am. Yes, heard what noun it is. Collective Bef noun. Yes, collective noun. Make it very quick. Yes, collective noun. Yes, very good. Collective noun. Now, Thank you, ma'am. Yes, Jessica, are you there? Jessica, come on. Horse, what noun it is? Jessica. Horse, no, what noun no. it is? Yes, very good. It is common no, noun. No. Yes, horse it is. What noun it is, Jessica? A little more clearer. No, no. Yes, common noun. So I have to color it in. Color no, it in. No. Hello, very good. Very good, Jessica. Okay, very good. Now let's move on to the next person. Why some of you, all of you turn on your videos. Agnel Joshi, come on, Agnel. Yes, we have finished. Few more words are left. Team, come on, tell me. Agnel. Agnel. What color? No, uh, team, what noun it is? Team, what noun it is? Unmute it. Mm. Team, what noun it is? Collective. Saying the answer. It is what noun it is? Agnel, what noun it is, my dear? It is team. We have learned only few collective nouns. When you look at the words, you're not able to identify or what. Whether it's... Ah. Agnel, you're not there? Mm, what noun it is, team? Are you taking such a lot of time to answer the question? Ah, team, what noun it is? What kind of noun it is? Team, whether it's common noun, proper noun or collective noun. It is a... Who can give me the answer? Raise your hands. Team is whether it's a audio problem. I could not hear you. Huh? Team, what noun it is, my dear? It's not clear. Okay. I couldn't hear you. Maybe some audio disturbances are there. Okay, then I'll move on to Rohan. Rohan, come on, tell me the answer. Team, sorry. Yes. Collective noun. Yes, it's collective noun. So I have to color it in blue. blue. Okay. I have to color it in blue. I like okay, my dear. Yes. Okay. Now let's move on to. Yes. Yes, we'll move on to a few more. Are there children? Just we'll finish off with this, this exercise. Mm. Anna Maria? Mm. Yes. Mm. Others, please mm. mute your audios, my dear children. Please do mute your audios. Mm. I could hear mm. unnecessary noise from everywhere. Okay. Uh, Abba, come on, Abba. Come on, tell me. Flock, what noun it is? Yes, ma'am. Flock. Flock. It's collective noun. Very good. It is collective noun. So I have to color it in? Blue. Blue, very good. Flock. Yes, very good. Then... Andrea, come on, Andrea. Bill Gates, what noun it is? Bill Gates. Common noun. How come? Bill Gates, when you look at the name, it, it doesn't sound that it's the name of a person. Bill Gates. So. Proper noun. 
It's a proper noun. So I have to color it in. Green. Green. Yes. Yes. Now. Now, who hasn't got the chance? Agnes has got it. Evelyn, come on, Evelyn. Shawl, what noun it is? Collective noun. Yes, very good. It is collective noun. So, what we have to do? We have to color it in blue. Okay. So, we have to color it, color it in blue. Yes. Okay, then. Now, let's move on to... The next person, Adidev Cian, did you get the chance? Adidev Cian, come on. Bell, what noun it is? Bell. Bell, what noun it is? Come on, Adidev, I couldn't hear you. Proper noun. Bell, what noun it is? Bell. Common. common noun, my dear. It is a common noun. Okay. Children, you are getting confused with com proper noun and common noun. Common nouns are common names. Okay. Proper nouns are special names, I've told you. Now, let's move on to the next question. One more is there. The final one. Adidev, did I ask you? Yes, I hope so. Mayuga, come on. Adidev, I didn't ask you. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Mayuga, come on. Yes. Egypt, what noun it is, Mayuga? Yes, ma'am. Egypt, what noun it is? Proper noun. Yes, it's proper noun. So I have to color it in. Green. Green. Very good. So have all of you, all of you, please have a look at these, uh, this uh, worksheet. This is like an activity. Okay. Yeah. So you have few words here. You have to color it in different colors. Your common noun, proper noun and collective noun. So the different words are given here. We have to identify whether it's common noun, proper noun or collective noun. Okay. So with this, we have come to the end of today's session. So I hope you have understood. Please do Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Yes, bye. Yes, yes, bye. Yes, bye. Yes, bye. 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 All of you, please do listen. Please do prepare well for your exams, for your periodical tests. Go through each worksheet very well. Okay? So it's time for us to wind up today's session. Bye, bye children. Thank you all. Bye. Bye, children. Bye, all of you. Bye, bye. Bye, children. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. 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 b